everyone and welcome back to the trailer park challenge i'm b bunny i'm so glad you're joining me here today uh so when i first loaded up the game is that like green scary or is that actually gone off okay maybe that's just green scary oh, sorry got distracted uh but when i first loaded up the game i saw this george lee has entered the picky eater phase i don't think that's ever occurred uh to any of my kids before so i was looking at it and it basically means that he just wants to eat his favorite quick meal all the time which is hilarious because the last time in the last uh, episode, I believe the entire time George had this negative moodlet because he'd been eating too many quick meals. Look at him doing laundry, though. Um, I'm kind of worried you're going to... Okay, good. <laughs> you're just putting it in? Oh, no, 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 no. No, because he's going to start this laundry and he's not going to finish it, you guys, because nobody actually finishes laundry on their own. You have to make them. <laughs> they get tired. I don't even know if the water is clean. Is the water clean? Oh, okay. At least the water is clean. Oh, my God. I can't believe he's doing this on his own. George has just gone through so much, you guys. He's just been... This, this angsty teen and, but such a sweet kid, like, you know, he'll just occasionally just do stuff like this, like take out the trash or do the laundry or, you know, interact with his little sisters in a very loving way. Proud of you, George, and I hope you make it through these teen years. I hope you do. We actually only have another, I think, game week left for George to be a teen until he grows up to a young adult. I cannot believe it. But tomorrow is Lucy's birthday. So she will be growing up um, into a teen. And then we'll have three uncontrollable Sims in the house because part of the challenge rules, uh, in, in case you're just joining me uh, for this, is that teens, I can't, I can't make them do anything. I can't direct them to do anything. I've just got to let them be and let them live. The only thing that I can do is have the parents hopefully influence them in a positive way and, and try to get them to take care of their needs. But that hasn't worked very well <laughs> recently. It really hasn't. Oh, I hope I picked the right toilet. This Pearl's going to the toilet too. So it is Thursday morning. Wait, is today Lucy's birthday or is tomorrow? Okay, it's tomorrow. Tomorrow is Lucy's birthday. Uh, so it's Thursday morning. Um, last time we had our sale and I have immediately spent all the money. I spent all the money in the in the episode. <laughs> I, didn't even, I just didn't even wait. So we're back down to uh, 272 simoleons and we've got a few days until our bills come and I think Anya has a couple of work days. Oh no, toilet is broken. Candace, that's you. You are our handiness gal. Gal? I don't know what that was. Gal. Handiness gal. <laughs> oh gosh. So yeah, Lucy's still in her loud phase. Clearly Pearl is very annoyed by it. I get you. I feel you, Pearl. I had a very loud sibling too. It was not fun. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Pearl! Oh, well, fortunately, I can control you, girl. So I'm going to have you turn it off. Oh my god! George actually finished the laundry! You guys, it's a miracle. I, have, I mean, even when I tell them to do the laundry, sometimes they don't finish it. George! Amazing George! Amazing, George. I wish I could do something for you. You have to go to school, but I guess you're going to go to sleep. But your mom's in there. I guess that tent, like, holds more than one person. <laughs> I guess it's big enough for at least two. I wonder if the bigger one actually holds, like, a family of four or something. I, I have never really paid that close attention. Luke, you were looking so much better. Oh, Cece. Cece still got the cone. Cece looks like there's something wrong, and I don't know... If it's just that she's tired of this cone. Oh, we can remove it. We can remove it. But let's see what's wrong. Oh, look at these two girls. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, except for Lucy did not like that. <laughs> Lucy, Lucy is going through a phase herself. I'm hoping maybe when she grows up, she'll, she'll grow out of this, <laughs> this loud face. But I have a feeling it's going to get worse. And Mary Sue is headed to school. 
badly needing a bath, at least there's bathrooms at the campus that she can go to use the toilet, but she's just going to be stinky. You know what? You're not so bad, George. You think you'll be okay. Okay, pets and cuddles are in order for CC. Let's hug. Let's cheer up. And why don't we give her a brush and take care of her? You should be going to work, right? And I think you you can eat at work. Yeah, okay, so you, you're taking care of yourself. That's great. That's great. You go, Anya. Okay. Oh, brushing the doggies. Brushing the doggies. So cute. Oh, Luke. You know what? I forgot because I was considering selling... Do we have stuff? Do we need to cook more things? I think we need to cook more things. All right, well, let's serve some. You know what? Let's just cook something that can be all the time, not just breakfast. Grilled cheeses are always good. Let's make a big party size of grilled cheese. We got a big family. <laughs> you know, I was thinking about selling the the woohoo bush, the, the pea bush, um, just because the dogs are constantly getting in there. And then I was wondering if I should wait until... Oh, I know. It's a new stove. It's so nice, isn't it? I was wondering if I should wait until we got the whole feather collection since we are so close and getting all the feathers. But, oh, gosh, it's just so annoying. I know. <laughs> it's just so annoying that they're constantly in that bush fighting squirrels and getting sprayed by skunks. Cece wants a walk. You know, maybe we can go on a little walk. Oh, too many chores. It, like All I had to do was, like, clean the clean the sink and it's too many chores for you <laughs> oh goodness oh the bills i'm not sure if anya is gonna make enough oh but you know what our bill should be less since we only have one stereo now instead of like one plus the three broken out in the yard and the tv was broken out in the yard so that's good but it might be good for uh, Candace to go for, maybe we can have her go for a jog with one of the dogs. They both want to go real bad. Oh, these poor puppies. Look, it's just you guys home alone in the house, so it's all about you guys right now. Oh, so sweet. Oh, Candace, it's like, look at the, you've got the whole day to yourself. Look at you. You could do some gardening. Oh, we can fertilize with the pet poop. Because we have all this collected. Cannot sell them, but we can harvest all and save them for next time. We need to take care of our bees a little bit. Collect the honey. I can't believe, I feel like this is like the first, like, I mean, I know it's just because everybody's away from the house, but I, this is the first time I've played in this house in a really long time where I'm not feeling stressed right now. It's like, well, we got all the time in the world to do our thing. Oh, goodness. Getting stung. I know, bees. I know. We haven't been very good to you. Oh, my gosh. We have a pet training skill. What? Oh, because we're playing fetch. Okay. I don't know if Luke is going to really understand that. He is not the smartest dog. Oh, but look at him go. Oh, he's going. Oh, he's getting it. Oh, good. Oh, good for you, Luke. Oh, good for you. Oh, that's so sweet. All right, Anya's home. Yeah, she only brought home 300. And why don't you go have some fun, girl? Pick something out to do. Really, a book? That's what you picked? Okay. Three. Stress from training. <laughs> Unsuccessful dog tricks. Oh my gosh. You know, Candace isn't the most patient. She's she probably Oh my god, here. Luke, you got it right on the first try. No, Luke's like, I just don't even know. I just don't even know. It's okay. Alright, we can stop this. We don't need to get frustrated. Oh my goodness. It is just a doggy day, isn't it? Although her fun is not going up, and I really don't understand. Because what could be more fun than cuddling with your doggy on a couch. I don't understand why your phone's not going up, but I was going to say you should watch TV, but there's there's no TV. I just don't understand because I didn't think Cece would want to go on a walk. Why don't we do... Can we go... Okay, go for a jog. Why don't we go for a jog? Maybe that'll be fun. Will that be fun for you, Anya? Oh, oh! Oh, gosh, here comes 
the tired and stinky and dirty kids. I was going to say, let's get Mary Sue in the shower, but we can't. So Mary Sue's just going to have to decide. But Lucy, you can nap. And Pearl, oh, you are napping. You know what's up. You're taking care. You are taking care. Um, are you doing the walk? Are we doing it? Are we going for a little jog? I, you know what? The jog might have been the wrong thing for for little Cece because <laughs> she's a couch potato dog. Um, oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Okay, this is so cute. Oh my gosh, we have to. Oh no! Oh gosh, I hope Cece survives this. <laughs> I just, I just, what is happening? It was a very good dramatic face right there. I mean, don't you think? It's a very good dramatic face. Oh my. I just feel like this is so much for Cece. <laughs> I just feel like this is so much for her. This is the most activity she's gotten in her whole little life. Luke. All right. Well, while Luke is doing that, why don't you open this and see what you got? Oh, I'm sorry. George was going to talk to you. How are you doing? Sprayed by a skunk. Okay, we're not taking you for a walk. We're giving you a bath. That was another thing is I was going to sell these feathers and I forgot. Oh, no, this one's new. Oh, cool. Oh, my God. Mary Sue, get yourself to a shower. <laughs> okay, it's either one we only had one of and it's already up here. No, it's a new one. Yay. Oh, we only have one feather left. Oh my gosh. As soon as we find that feather, you guys, I'm going to like build some kind of fence or something to go around that bush so the dogs can't access it. That's my plan. Once we get that last feather, because we're so close, you know, we might as well go for it. Just so precious. You guys can tell I have dogs, right? Because I just love, <laughs> love these dogs so much. Okay, you are taking a shower. I was going to say, do we have to bring out the moms? Are you guys on the way home? Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh, Anya. Where is Cece, though? <gasps> Cece, go home. Oh, my God. She just left you? Please tell me you're coming home. I cannot believe, Anya. I know you're, like, filthy, but you should have just brought, you should have brought your dog home. That's not very responsible. I'm filthy and gross and I just don't care. Oh, infected. The very, very something something's happening here. Cece's like, just 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 let's just walk very slow. Let's just let's just not call attention to ourselves. Let's just let's just let's just let's just be real suave and real cool about it. Can't just love sleeping standing up. Luke, didn't we just do Oh, we were gonna take you for a walk, but we had to give you a bath instead because you were you were bad and played with the squirrel. Argue about house rules. <laughs> oh, where was that when she skipped class? Um, can we influence to do homework? And then you can go to sleep, Anya. I never put Pearl into an after school activity. I'm going to think that she's just not into, you know, organized after school activities. Be begged for toys. <laughs> oh, girl. Okay, um, Candace, why don't you influence your son to do his homework? They just do not take care of themselves very, very well. Influence to do homework. Did, did, did Mary Sue get influenced to do her homework and now she's, oh no, she's sick. Oh, uh, well, all we could really do... I think Mary Sue, like, picked up her homework book and then just put it away and went to the bathroom. I mean, she did have to go in her defense, <laughs> but I don't think she's actually going to do it. What about, what about George? Are we successful here? Oh, George is like, why did you sell my clothes at the summer sale? I didn't really appreciate that, Mom. And now you're, like, telling me to do my homework? I'm... I don't have to do my homework. I can do whatever I want. I'm a grown-up, you know? I'm a grown-up. Man, look at that look. He's just like... He's not... In, he's not a happy kid right now. It's like, Mom, you're not funny. Okay, maybe you're funny. Okay, maybe you're a little funny. Okay, now she, she buttered him up with a joke. And he's like, yeah, sure, I'm going to do my homework. 
was just kidding, Mom. Luke's like, can someone take me for a walk? Should we do a late night walk? Oh, what you need? A hugs? I mean, we have been, we paid attention to you all day. <laughs> oh my gosh. So precious. All right, let's go for a jog. Let's go for a jog. Candace is going to hate me, but let's just do it. Let's do it. This is the first time Candace has worn her athletic wear in her whole entire life. Like, I'm not even joking. This is the first time. So, we all, oh, y'all enjoy this. She's going to be real stinky afterwards, but you guys enjoy this. I think Luke is having a great time. Why do they look so weird when they're running, though? These dogs look so weird when they're running. Uh, I think everybody else is asleep. Oh, I thought she was going to give up right there. I mean, I wouldn't have been surprised. <laughs> I wouldn't have been surprised. Oh, she's so dirty now. Oh, this is why. They give up. Hold on. Can we just take him home, though? If we leash... Um, if we leash him again and go home, will he come with us? He's like, I don't want to be leashed. Unless we're going to play or go for a walk. A girl, go home and, and, and do something with yourself. I really should change their clothes because this is not a summer outfit. <laughs> Does this not work like I think it's supposed to work? Luke is just trying to catch his tail. Just, okay. Okay, there we go. All right, we just had to wait for Luke. Can you, can you take a shower before you go to bed? Oh my gosh, look at these filthy clothes. <laughs> You know, amazingly, we've kept up with our laundry pretty well. I'm very surprised. George, you are stinky and you need to sleep. And I know you need some fun, but I would think that the bathing and the sleeping would be more important than just starting a fire. Oh my goodness, George is actually going to take a shower. Praise be. Oh no, is, is this Mary Sue's homework? I'm just going to click on it and see. Do Oh, my God. Mary Sue. I don't know. Can I drag it to her inventory? <laughs> Is that against the rules? I guess I just got to leave it there. Oh, my God. Let's complain about our problems to the dog. I mean, I just think that's something Candace would do. My kids are failing at school. They're actually not doing too bad. George won't stay off his phone. She's having a lot of problems with school and cell phones. <laughs> And Luke is like, you know what I liked when we took that jog? That was fun. That's what you should do. I would like to adult now. Obviously, he's talking to Candace because I is asleep. This is this is this makes sense for George. I feel like I'm old enough now that I should be allowed to go anywhere I want and do whatever I want. George, you are doing whatever you want. No one is telling you what to do. So for like the very brief moment, I actually managed to get one of your moms to tell you to do your homework. <laughs> Can you treat me like an adult, please? Uh, you'll always be my baby, or not until you've grown more, or we'll see what we can do. You know, I'm saying not until you've grown more, because George, George, you are not a grown-up yet. You are not a grown-up. Uh, I know you're going through a lot and feeling a lot of things, and you feel like you know everything, and... And you're just ready to take on the world. But you clearly cannot care for yourself. Because you're going to bed 45 minutes before you've got to leave for school. <laughs> I mean, I think our kids get along pretty well. I mean, save for like a little spots here and there. I think they're doing pretty good, honestly. Alright, girl. Why don't you take a shower? And you could cook the cake. Cook the cake. Because that's what we do in The Sims. We don't bake cakes. We cook them. I wonder if we're going to be able to afford a TV. We're going to have to wait for bills, but I would really like to buy another TV for them. It just doesn't feel right. <laughs> no, is that, so, is that so wrong of me to feel that way? It just feels like they, I mean, they don't have a computer. They don't have anything. They just have this little boom box. Oh my God, you do not need to be in that. You do not need to be in that. <laughs> no, it's so hot. Oh my gosh. I was thinking I need to give everyone kind of an update and close anyway. So maybe I will do that. But, you know, after, I'm going to do it after Lucy's birthday because I more, more than likely want to go in 
and, and look at her teen clothes and change some things. But, um, but gosh, she does not need to be wearing that heavy jacket right now. So yeah, let's go ahead and cook this cake and get it ready. And you're not starving, so you will likely not just eat it. We've had lots of chocolate cakes lately. And there are other cakes to make. There's a coconut cake. There, let's make a strawberry. Let's make a strawberry cake. It's, it's, it's vegetarian, right? Is that what it said? Because for some reason, now I'm panicking. I don't know why a strawberry cake wouldn't be vegetarian. <laughs> I don't know. But vegetarian safe, yeah. I, just, I saw the optional out of the corner of my eye, and I thought, vegetarian optional? I'm like, what kind of meat are they putting in this strawberry cake? Should Mary Sue invite, invite over Evie? I'm going to just say okay. I'm going to say okay to things like that because... I feel like, girl, why don't you just eat this grilled cheese sandwich and not all the candy? All of a sudden, they, that's all they want to do is eat candy. All right, Candace is starving. Let's get these birthday candles on here. Pearl is a straight-A student, of course. Oh, Lucy is too. Yay, Lucy, you're going to age up as a straight-A student. So let's let's throw a party. We know a house party, if it gets really good, it's a really expensive stereo. And otherwise, it's a sofa. So I think we should just do a house party. And let's invite Lucy and Pearl, of course. But Roxana's family. Oh my gosh, is that all you know, Anya? Or is that just all that's available? Because you have your whole club. Unless you just don't know them anymore. And who is Hobart Crook? Uh, I don't know who that is, so we're not going to invite. So I guess it's just... And then, like, Evie's coming over. Okay, okay. I feel like... You know what? I'm just going to real quick modify Anya's party wearing cast because it just it just bothers me so that it's just like it's so hot I just want it to be something cooler so we just do this real quick I think that looks nice I know that seemed a little silly it's just really bothered me that she was in that such a like a, a winter looking outfit but uh, so now we've got her in this kind of a nicer top and nice shorts so she's like kind of casual but still ready to party but still plenty cool Plenty cool, so she wouldn't get too hot. And let's see, we're having a party, right? So we need to socialize. If um, if we socialize with Evie, will that count? Let's meet Evie. Uh, it looks like Lucy wants to play chess for her birthday. Do you want to join the game? And we'll have two people playing a game. What are you? Oh, you making some food? All right. Somebody already knocked over the trash can. <laughs> And now they're hanging out by the trash can. Is the door... <gasps> the door is not... Ah, uh, the door is locked. Okay, I was like, why are they hanging out about the trash can? <laughs> Again. <laughs> That's not good. Let's unlock. Okay. Um, now nobody is playing games. Okay. Well, we've got to start up a game of cards. Maybe the kids can do the cards. And you need to play an instrument. I'm going to have you do it because you're always the one that does it. I know you're serving some food. Oh no, now you're dancing. Oh my gosh, just leaving the clothes everywhere once again. <laughs> Let's just put these in your inventory really quick. Oh, the Spice Festival is on. We need to socialize. We need to socialize with people. So, <laughs> oh my god, we also need to do this. Pick this up. Throw this away. And let's think, let's, oh. We know him. Didn't we know him? I don't know. I don't know, but let's talk to him. What are you doing, George? Oh, George is sleeping in Pearl's bed. Oh, she's embarrassed <laughs> because her guitar skills so bad and she's playing in front of people, but but you got to for an hour. Oh, Pearl's on her way from becoming to becoming a true savant. That's great. Um yes, yes, of course you can come over and hang out. We're having a party. We are having a party, and so far we haven't socialized with anybody, and we we need to socialize with people. Lucy, it's like, for my birthday, can someone just fix this, please? All right. It's just, we just need, okay, she played the musical instrument for an hour. Oh, eating cake. Eating cake. Okay. Lucy. 
Let's blow out the candle so everybody can eat some cake. All right, let's make a wish. Oh my gosh, Lucy. Lucy. You're going to be a teen, girl. You're going to be a teen. And uh, I will have her quit the scouts. I will remember to do that. Oh gosh, here we go. Yay! Oh my god, there's actually more people around to watch her than anybody else. <laughs> Look at all these people celebrating. Alright. Okay, randomize a good trait. Unflirty. Unflirty. She is squeamish and unflirty. Well, I have to say, you guys, if Lucy ends up winning the poll to be the next heir, we're, we're going to have... This is going to be a challenge. <laughs> <laughs> That's going to be a challenge because she is going to be unflirty. You know how hard it is to get an unflirty person in a relationship. <laughs> Let's go for her aspiration. I'm hitting the randomizer. Let's go for here. So we have 12 options. We got option seven, which is fortune. <laughs> okay. She either wants to be fabulously wealthy or a mansion baron. And she wants to be fabulously wealthy. We got one. Um, yeah. Well, I'm just saying if Lucy ends up being the heir to the trailer, <laughs> that'll be interesting. That'll be interesting. Oh my gosh. What an outfit, you guys. <laughs> like, what is this? What is this with the gym shorts and the, <laughs> the leather vest? <laughs> Oh my god. Girl. Girl. We're going to have to do something about your outfits. I I just... I need y'all to do something about your outfits. Um, let's see. You're eating chili. I don't know where anybody got chili. But um, let's call to meal here. Because everybody needs to eat some cake. And we've got to start talking to people. Um, that's always our problem. For some reason, socializing with guests is like... Is she a teen or is she an adult? No, she's an adult. Is like the hardest thing to do for some reason. I just, I don't know why. I don't know why. I don't care what you talk about. You just gotta talk with your guests. Kind of nice. Everybody hanging out together. Oh, it looks like Roxana's enraged. I do not know. What, maybe she's going through something. Okay, so we've got to socialize four more times, and we need to flirt. And, girl, you're going to have to flirt with your wife. Because, <laughs> oh, my gosh. We don't want to flirt with anybody else. Sniff fresh clothing? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> We have to sniff the fresh clothing. Oh, look at George cleaning up. That's nice of you, George. Okay, I've got to see the sniffing of the fresh clothing. I guess it's not going to happen while they're eating. But I have to see it. Is this going to happen yet? Is the sniffing of the fresh clothing going to happen? I mean, we did get silver. So, oh, she did just sniffed it. She just sniffed it. <laughs> that was the weirdest thing. Is that it? Okay, we got it. Oh, no. Oh, no, that didn't get us gold. I thought that was going to get us gold. But it did not get us gold. And I don't know how we're going to get three sims flirty, honestly, by the time this timer. So I think we'll just... Mary Sue, what you doing over there? Mary Sue's teaching herself how to cook. What is she cooking? Eggs and toast. Okay. All right. And then Candace is going to make some food. Because everybody needs, like, to make some food. All right, well, we got a silver medal, you guys. Not a bad party. And Mary Sue learned some recipes. Look at all this food. Why, why is all this food up? <laughs> Let's just put all this food up. I still don't know who made this chili. I missed it completely. Let's put all this food up. And Lucy. Oh, I almost took away his cake. Um, I would like to adult now. <laughs> she just became a teen. 
You're always gonna be my baby. She just became a teen. <laughs> Lucy. Um, okay, girl. Oh my god, you're very playful. I'm a little worried for you. Um, all right, my last official thing. Is, is it quit job or something? That's my last official thing to do is to get her out of the scouts. Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. And then I would really like to do some editing because what is this outfit? What is this outfit? I mean, she's kind of like taking after her mom with the top, but I, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, she's going to play with the doggy. All right. Well, <laughs> We have three uncontrollable teens in the house, as if I do a good job controlling any of them, really. And, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and leave it here. And I guess we will see uh, what's going to happen after... <laughs> after Pearl grows up and then it's just going to be chaos. Although I think George becomes a young adult before Pearl becomes a teen actually. So, uh, so yeah, we're going to have to decide pretty soon about who is going to run the trailer for the next generation, run the trailer like it's a business. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, if you guys want to vote, if you have an opinion, leave a comment down below. Uh, you can still vote for George uh, and uh, Mary Sue and, and Lucy. They're all still available, but oh my god. <laughs> okay, I won't say it. I won't say it. I won't tell you not to give me Lucy, because then you'll give me Lucy, but... It's going to be, it's going to be something if Lucy wins. I just have to say, it's going to be something. It's going to be a whole new different challenge than just having a lazy sim in the house. <laughs> but you guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and leave this here. I'll probably edit Lucy a little bit off screen. And, and when we come back, we can see her new look. And we'll probably celebrate another birthday because it feels like that's all we do. I'm going to sell that couch. We're going to get our bills in a couple of days and hopefully we can afford them. And yeah, I think things are going pretty good though. All right, you guys, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to my channel and I will be back with another update soon. <laughs> Thanks you guys. Bye.